hi guys and gals so it's Christmas and today I'll be cutting my sorrel to make sorrel in Jamaica at Christmas time we make sorrel and we bake fruitcake so you know I plant my own sorrel so at Christmas time I'll be able to pick my sorrel and make my drink because sorrel now is one of the super food and it's a super drink so a lot of persons now tend to be drinking sorrel using sorrel in drinks sorrel in cake sorrel wine and sorrel 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 so this is me now picking my sorrel and i'm gonna make my sorrel drink Now I put on my water to boil and in it I'm going to put this piece of ginger. Allow it to boil and when it starts boiling I'm going to come and put my sorrel in there. So my ginger is boiled in the pot so it's now boiling so I'm going to add my sorrel. Add my sorrel to the boil water right and leave it I probably leave it for a uh, 10 minutes then I turn off the fire and allow the sorrel to right so see there so it's gonna boil let it boil for another 10 minutes or I could just turn it off now because the water is already boiled but I'm gonna let it boil for 10 minutes turn it off and when it cool I'm gonna mix it with my granulated sugar and white rum so I'm gonna show you what the finished product looks like after I'm finished alrighty so that is Jamaican Christmas sorry. So now that I'm finished boiling the sorry. Put the granulated sugar in it. And you're gonna season to taste, right? I <laughs> don't season to taste. It's sweet to taste. <laughs> funny, funny, funny in that chicken. <laughs> oh my god, this is so funny. That's why you said cooking it. I'm talking about season to taste. It's not season to taste. It's sweet into taste. Alright, so after you mix it with your granulated sugar. That's how I usually do it. Mix it first with the sugar. And then you see it having all of this ginger. And see there now. Nice and I taste it. Now, if you were somebody who didn't like rum or red label, then this would have been fine. All you have to do is just strain it into a container, put it in the fridge to cool, and then you're good to go. But because I like rum and wine, so what I'm going to do is strain my sorrel in this bowl. Okay. This is it. I 
and then I'm gonna put well a bit of red label so I guess if you look and see how much I pour in there you know I like when my drink have spirit in there and some wine so it's wine and ray and if you overproof rum then I'll transfer it to another container put it in my fridge and that's my sorry for Christmas right so guys follow me at Yvonne Smith Tracy right and at Lady Sweaty right so like my videos subscribe to my channel and leave a comment and thanks for watching bye